In this video, we'll see how to use Oracle substring and string functions. We are going to try out substring and string functions using this uh, table which I have created. Uh, it's just an uh, example for substring and string. So the table structure and uh, the data is available in my website. So go to anganesh.com and uh, you can get the SQL statement. And it's in the substring and string function example. Okay, having said that, so I will talk, my requirement out here is right, to have the title, first name and last name to be shown separately. So the title must should appear in one column, the first name in one column and the last name in one column. So as we have seen in the earlier uh, video, we can use the substring function to get only the first few characters we can get. And uh, similarly, right, uh, here the title ends with uh, the dot uh, symbol, the, the dot character. So how to get up to the dot character, we will see in the below examples. Okay, so now if you I run this, when I say select substring of full name, comma, one, comma, three, I'm getting only the first three characters. So in case of miss, another S yes and the dot is missing. In case of misses, the dot is missing. So what we can do is right, we can try to get the exact position of this dot or uh, the dot using the uh, instring function. So here I run the instring full name comma and then write end of line the dot symbol and I say from ex substring. So in case of Mr. it says 3, 5, 4, 3. So what I have to do basically is to get the title. I have to substitute this instring function in the place of 3. So if I do that, what I get is select substring of full name comma 1 comma in string from x substring. Right? So now I got the title separately. How we did it? We used the substring function from the first character till which position till the dot I want. So I've used the in string function. Right? So the in string function till the dot shows me 3, 5, 4, 3. So I got the title here by using the substring and string function. So my next requirement is to get the uh, first name. So here the first name, right, first name starts from the fourth character and it's till the uh, space is encountered, that's the first name. So in here it's Neil, Taylor, Helen and Rakesh. I want these uh, words to be there as part of the first name. So how I can achieve it, right? So what we do here in the below example, right, I'm just trying to, just giving a full name and then I'm just saying, printing the in string occurrence of the dot, it's in the third position and the occurrence of the space, right, between the Neil and Johnson, there's a space. So occurrence of the space in which position I'm getting. So the next step now is, right, I want, uh, we will get the substring of full name then 3 plus 1, 4, and then after that how many characters I want is basically 8 minus 3, right? 8 minus 3 gives me 5 and then another minus 1 will give me these four characters. Why I'm doing minus 1? Because this is the position of the space, so I want to exclude the space, so I'm doing minus 1. So 8 minus 3 minus 1. So I'll start from the fourth position until which position I want. 8 minus 3 minus 1. Same with here, Taylor as well. Taylor, I want to start from the 6th position. And then how many characters? 12 minus 5, 7 minus 1. 6 characters I want. T A Y L O R. So that's what we have tried here. Select substring, full name, comma. And string of full name dot plus 1 I'm doing. Because plus 1 is from the N I want. And then I'm doing this minus this. And as I said, minus 1 from the first string. So three parameters. Let's run the SQL and see what we get. Cool. So we get Neil, Taylor, Helen and Rakesh. So my next requirement is to get Johnson and other details separately. Right, Johnson, Williamson, Rams and Sharma. So how I'm going to get this, right, this is again, I have to, after the space, any number of characters, right? After the space, any number of characters. After the space, any number of characters. So what I do is select substring of full name comma and then I just say in string of space plus one. So this is what I do to get the last name. 
substring of full name comma it's only two parameters here from this string from which position I want to print after the space so I'm saying after the space plus one from that character print all the characters so I'm getting Johnson, Williams and Ram Sharma so whatever the sequels that we have executed above I have clapped all the sequels below and you get to see the substring of title uh, the first name and then the last name as well along with the full name so let me run the SQL for you now so now what you see is you see title separately first name last name and full name is given here for an example right so this is how we can use substring and instring functions together in a nested fashion thank you